Hello everybody, welcome to the card for Monday Night Claw on uh, the 8th of June 2020. Um, first up we've got an amazing Fatal 4-Way Money in the Ass qualifier. Amazing matchup here, you've got Flicky Flack, Jimmy, F who is the current uh, internet champion, Jimmy Fantastic himself, G'day Nick, and then Marcel rounding out, a, a bit of a four-man specialist is Marcel, so that's... Uh, that's pretty cool. Even though he doesn't really win them, he does really well in them. Um, he hasn't. I don't think we've seen him win one yet, but he has held his own. Obviously, Kadir Nick, the Blitzbit organizer. It's great to see him in action. Um, then we've got, this is interesting. It's uh, Chunter and Finney, the fucking rats. An incredible record they have. They haven't been on TV for a while. And here they're up against Scotch Milk. Can Scotch Milk coexist? Wendy will be ringside. And will there be something, uh, something crazy happen in this match? Maybe. Um, basically, this is Scotch Milk trying to stay alive as a tag team. Can they can they beat the fucking rats and justify their existence? Uh, and we've got Baker's has been on a bit of a tear since joining the JFW. He's up against Rick Reckless, who's also been on a on a tear recently. So this should uh, this should be an amazing match. Two fantastic competitors there. And now we've got EAB versus Tarsis versus the Kurgle in a triple threat match. This is very interesting. Tarsis did beat Extra Armspot. Whether Extra Armspot was giving his all then or not, we don't know. And uh, Kurgol did get beaten by him, but... Um, or did he win? I don't know. <laughs> Something happened when Kurgol fought EAP. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> that's, uh, that's not good, is it? That's not good not knowing that. Um... No, I believe Kurgol beat him. I believe Kurgol beat Extra Armspot, yeah. So, wow, so they've both beaten Extra Armspot. Um, he's he's lost twice in a row, Extra Armspot, yeah, that's true. He's lost three times on Monday Night Claw, so this is uh, this is going to be tough for him to win with three anyway. So this is a battle of dominance, really, between the three uh, the three super heavies there. They're definitely these three are the top three super heavies, if you don't count flat fat. <laughs> Right, and then we've got Bezel versus... Who had his chance and lost? Right, Bezel versus Squirrel Dude in a one-on-one -on -one normal match. Uh, Bezel, you know, being quite on a tear, so is Squirrel Dude, so they're going to face off, see who the better man is. But um, it's still gearing up this rivalry between Squirrel Dude and Clavius. So Squirrel Dude getting his rematch versus Clavius, but, you know, this is just a, a good match. And then we've got kind of a make-a-wish scenario as Azunga <laughs> takes on Goliath. <laughs> Azunga really, I think, has a bit of a. I mean, when I say a bit, a massive man crush on Goliath. So they're gonna, they're gonna, you know, settle that in the ring. And then the main event is the final of the tournament to determine the the number one competitors to the fucking Rats Tag Team Title. And the former champs, Das Hats, have made it the final, Lingari and Oriolensis, to take on Lemon Is Good and Fant Fox. And the winner of this will be will be fighting for the championship in the Money in the Ass pay-per-view on, I believe, the 21st of June. Is that correct? Yes, it is. So there you go. Glorious. Um, it should be an amazing show. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.